I see so many beautiful ladies here in church today. I'm not only talking about beauty in the ecstatic way, but beauty that only God can create. But I see so few men here today. Welcome to another episode of the Real Life of the Real First Lady. Listen. That's a doggone shame. He won't even pay for it. So what we're talking about is my husband, the man of God, he has a $700 and something phone. Okay. So I don't know how much the plastic cover was, but it was like $60 or something. Well, anyways, he he cracked it. So Sydney was like, well, you need to go get another um, cover. He said, I'm not paying. <laughs> he, he said, I'm not paying $10 for no cover. He says, um, I'm paying a couple dollars for the cover. Cheap. And if I can't see the numbers, I just can't see the numbers. Now, who does that? Secondly, he don't even know how to use a phone. Really, that should be my phone. And he should have the other phone. But I ain't down with the payments. His phone payments are outrageous. But he don't even he know what to this. He don't even know what to do with the phone. So we thought it was pretty hilarious. So he's in there um getting gas for the car. So I thought that was quite hilarious. hilarious that he would do something like that. And then y'all, okay, so like because he drives a truck, women be trying to talk to him, right? What Sydney said? <laughs> what you say, Sydney? I said, you don't want them problems. She would not last for a week. She wouldn't last for a week. Her hair would have been, she would have pulled her <laughs> hair out, would have been on the wall like a demon. <laughs> it would just, she would be no. down at the health department no. getting herself. Help me, no. A check, y'all. Please. please don't get them away from me, a monster. Because, it's like, monster. we're used to it. So all y'all running around right here talking about y'all want a husband. I don't want that. You do not. We're my, me and Cindy, we just don't like, we're cool with it. it. You guys don't know Look, what it's like to you be. You have a free trial. You don't know what it's like to be a PK kid. And you don't know how what it's like to be a, a pastor's wife. Y'all, try it. Trial. Here you go. You'll I'm going to ship them in a box. She's going to pop out and scare you. You'll be running for the border. You think Trump is sending everybody off Shut over the border? No, you'd be running. Cause these men and guys just not mine. They crazy. They be doing way too much, and some of them don't want to work. I don't know where they get that from, but uh, we ain't even go there. But yeah, so here he comes. So yeah. But then he want to pay for that nine hundred dollar phone. So. Okay. Um, but he don't want to spend nothing on his six hundred dollar phone. So yeah, he don't want to. He don't want to um get a good. How much is a cover sitting for the phone? Ten dollars. He ain't gonna be able to do it. Here he comes. Where's the world gas gets so doggone hot? <laughs> what? is so high <laughs> but we need gas to get around <laughs> unless you want to get us a bicycle or something yeah, I, get you <laughs> I ain't got that to do <laughs> how much gas you put in car bag two dollars oh. what it's a, <laughs> it's a you. 15 dollars y'all I think he put twenty dollars worth gas in the car come on Apostle Allen <laughs> I guess you a big spender he's feeling his holy goals <laughs> god no man I guess he a big spender he now. He a big spender He's now. Himself. Ain't no big That's spender. That's the life of your life. Got a pocket rookie. full of money. Ain't no big Ooh. spender. Nope. Why are you trying to put that on me? Mm-mm. <laughs> 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 so. Uh, you eight gallons, too. That's it. He said you only got eight gallons, but here it is. Go ahead, babe. <laughs> Didn't I tell y'all? It did not tell y'all. But see, y'all be trying to get with Y'all don't want it. Y'all don't want that. You don't want it. Y'all be trying to get with these men of God. And listen, they be trying to talk to them, right? 
<laughs> Let me help you sisters out. Yeah, bird and poop down on the side of your car. They be trying to talk to him like, like oh, he a truck driver, right? My husband ain't giving up no coins. Well, when I say by his cover. When I say he ain't giving up no coins, y'all, if that's what you're looking for. Hey, 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 hey. What? But that ain't but that ain't moving. It will. Oh, dang. When I say he ain't giving up no coins. No. Now you can give him some. I'm gonna go back in the gas station, man. Your pump ain't working. <laughs> you can give him some co coins, but he's not giving y'all none. Mm, nope. <laughs> he ain't giving up no coins. No money. <laughs> so, if you looking for money, you you looking for the wrong thing, cause he, the man of God ain't giving up no coins. You gotta go up to Big Lapa or something. You gotta oh, no, force we already it got out of him. Okay. No, hard. we don't have to force it out of. We can get it, cause I know how to get the money. Ooh. But I'm talking about you girls. That's going after these apostles and pastors and stuff. It's a waste of time. You gotta get your own job. You gonna have to get and your own job because he's gonna be asking you for your tithe and your offering. Because he's not he, giving it up. He's not giving it up. I'm telling you. He, he ain't got that to do. You know what he's gonna say? <laughs> he's gonna say. Get a job. This is what he's gonna say. Mm -mm, I got the family. Mm -mm. <laughs> mm -mm. Oh, look, my wife. My wife so y'all don't try it. Walk away. Graciously walk away. Oh. No, we're gonna go to the other side town, Infinities. All the way over there. Well, he's gotta check on something. So I'm just telling y'all. FYI. Don't do it. Don't do it. Leave these men of God alone. Especially. Because at the end of the day, at the end of the day, I mean they be they be running up on it. I'm like, ah, really? You don't have enough money. Help me. Help. Me. They want some help, you're not getting none. Jesus. I'm telling you what it is. I'm forewarning you. Ain't gonna get nothing. Nothing. Oh, so that's, <laughs> nah, that's a dump yard. Is it? it? No, you ain't going over there. Yeah, that's a dump yard. Uh, what do you? Cause I seen a swift trailer over there. So when are you gonna start painting my car? Who? My car. When are we gonna paint it? Uh, it's the summer. Yeah, but it's probably gonna be around June. Probably uh, right after we. Yeah. Did I tell y'all I got a job? Yes, I got a really, really good job. I start May 1st. Hallelujah. God, yes, God bless me of for a really, happy. really, really good job. I'm happy. I need I need to check. Yes. She need a keep talking a check. I need a, I need yes. I need, I need a paycheck. Yes. I want to spend some money too. Oh, when I need a, a raise. I'm always been up money. You know that? Well, you know. Yeah, you need a raise, Sydney. She got good grades in school, so. How much she get a week? How much was her? $10. She had like $10. It's like $40 a month. The whole bunch of young girls don't get nothing. They don't get I nothing. I worked my behind, dog. She really did. She, she I'm did. tired. I'm running that F to the day. Well, you, do, you are going to need money for the summer to do stuff. I, I feel it. like a slave. Because you have to go to school? Yes. And don't get nothing for it. It's tough. It's That's what it is. <laughs> That's what happens when you go to school. You got to go to school. <laughs> And when you get out, you gotta get a job, you still feel like work sometimes. Like, yes. 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 That's when you're gonna really feel like that's lazy. Mm -hmm. Except on payday. Work. You go to work and then your whole check go towards bills. <laughs> All right, y'all. We'll see you after the commercial break. This is the real life of the real first lady. See y'all in a few minutes. Peace. You gonna be my spokesperson on my job? 
empty out my balls and need more money. So how much more money do you need, Sydney? I need a week. A week. Dollars. You need twenty dollars a week for an allowance. To live. At least. Y'all be talking about. She got about hot fries. And hot fries. And hot fries. And I'm not about to spend it some, on hot some, fries. Some, some, uh, uh, Okay, so if I give her 10, you give her 10. That's $20. That's, that's $80 a month. That's a whole month. Is that all you're asking? That's a whole lot of money. A whole lot of money, man. I can do $80. Yeah. So, that, so then you'll be able to get out of, because um, you have a baby yeah. ministry right now. <laughs> <laughs> so will that cut? the begging ministry out and so you know you have to pay your tithes off of that. Yep. I'll give you a no. Who? <laughs> That's don't do me like $2 a week you get $2 for, for your tithe and then you have to get an offering. $80 a month. $8 a month for your out of your book from the 80s. So that would be your tithes for the whole month would be $8 and then your offering would be I would say 5 so if you give thirteen dollars a month out of your eighty dollars, you still will be doing all right. You gotta give something. No, you gotta give God. He did that, but you can't have. And you will not live in the house with the curse. <laughs> I gotta pay my tithes. You gotta I'm pay you something. Six dollars. No, you want it's eight dollars. No, eight dollars. Ten percent of eighty dollars is eight dollars. Why are you trying to take my money? I ain't trying to take your money. That's God's you money. Do you, you, you want, you want, don't you want your money to be blessed? Okay, but you gotta pay a dollar on ten dollars. Every ten dollars you got, you need to pay a dollar. Now, if you only want to give six dollars, that's sixty dollars a month. That's what we can do that. <laughs> you can either pay six or eight. It's up to you. You choose. Six dollars. Okay, then that means you only get sixty dollars a month for allowance. I'm talking about twenty dollars. Twenty dollars a week is eighty dollars a month, which is. 10% of $80 is $8. It's still leaving you with $72. What you gonna do with $72? Mm -hmm. Well, I'm gonna take your money. Yeah, I'm gonna take your money. 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 I'm gonna I'm gonna take your money. 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 I'm gonna take Girlfriends that want to rock with Cindy. Y'all hey, better come with your own money. <laughs> she look, she look, she ain't paying for the meal. Believe that. Y'all go to eat. She ain't paying for the meal. She ain't paying for your meal. Mm -hmm. you, me, you ain't got no money. Oh, you gotta go back there and wash dishes. <laughs> the queen, you might as well go back there. Get here. Where's your apron? Here you go, child. I see you. Call me when you get home. You be you. at the big I she mean that she mean that with every fiber of her being. Because you know, she get like chips and snacks and stuff. And she be like, I ain't taking it to school. I'm be like, why? She said, because I'm tired of them baby. I'm like, everybody, she can't give this. And like, I asked her for a chip. Now she have a big old family bag of chips. She'll give me one chip. She ain't playing. So and I'm her mother. And he, she might give a dad one, but she and she ain't gonna give us nothing trust when I say she ain't giving it and she ain't taking care of no man either y'all I'm telling y'all y'all better come with a job yeah, you better go look I'm for not, another girl I'm not, I'm not taking care you better, you better find another girl cause she ain't the one I'm not saying <laughs> she not giving up no money she ain't doing it so far y'all the one of these Sydney's friends you yeah. gotta come with your own coins. Gas money, at least twenty dollars. And even when she get her own car, she's not like she don't get free rides. Not like you got to. You gotta give some gas money, but that's fair. That's, that's fair. Like, much is gas car? Dollar two dollars and forty. You, you can't again. ride for free. And I'm driving a Jeep. Look. Give me that money. She ain't on it. She ain't on it. Did you thought this was a free ride? 
Gene. You ain't getting no free rides. This ain't a charity. Shit. No, I ain't doing it. So the question is, are you willing to give your eight dollars a month tithe? Okay, you can get eight dollars. What about your offering? <laughs> <laughs> How you get blessed. I'll give you four dollars. Okay, Five. that's good. Okay. Five. Grace. Yeah. Right. Look. <laughs> she don't pay no bills. All she gotta do is. Oh, you know what you can save up for your beats. How much are beats? You don't want beats. She will want the beats if we was paying for it. Yeah, not sure. <laughs> Thank you, Diva. Now that she got paid for them, they stink. <laughs> they wasn't stink beats before. No, they stink now. <laughs> but they stink beats now. Okay. All right. She ain't paying for no stink beats, y'all. Don't call me stinky on phone. Oh, you But at the end of the day, I got something. All right. She got her coins. And mom, you be uh, burning a hole in your pocket. Expose, burn, sizzle, and then you gonna be asking me for something. Well, you know what? That's true. I did used to ask her for money, but this and time. And then I give you money. I do. So I'm not stingy. Okay, that's true. But mm -hmm. this time I got a plan. I'm gonna take my own self out a little allowance. Babe, do you give yourself an allowance? Give you money. You don't give yourself an allowance. You need to at least take $25 a week for yourself. Maybe later. I'm taking $25 out a week for myself because I get paid every week. So $25 a week and I'm taking my lunch. I don't believe in that. I might I might um, eat out once a week. I don't know how y'all do it. That junk add up. You know, you can spend like $50, $60 a week trying to call yourself eating out. I'm not trying to keep it up. I'm not trying to keep up with nobody. I'll take me a peanut butter jelly sandwich, lunch meat sandwich, and some chips. I can't do it. That's a lot of money. I need my money because I might want to go to the store and buy me something, buy some lipstick or something. I had this thing where I was really on the lipstick, so now I need to get more colors. But you can't do it if you don't have money. And then they got this ten dollar store out here, y'all. They got the cutest clothes ever. Oh my goodness cutest clothes ever. I know Sydney going to be buying her outfits. But if you save, if you take $10 out a week, well, no, not $10, $25, you can buy yourself stuff. All right, y'all. I'll see you guys in Walmart. Ta-ta. Okay. We're back into the house. Um, I came in here once before. And so I'm going to take you guys on a little mini tour. So... I'm going to start at the front door, so. I don't know what this little room is, y'all. I don't know. I don't know what this is. And then there's a bathroom right here. Bathroom. And then you come out the bathroom and come back this way. And here the... Babe, what is this room over here? By the front door. I just... This is confusing. I ain't no sound room. No, that way there was uh, this right here. This right here needs to be fixed. This and there's my husband sitting now on the chairs. I'm trying to take you guys upstairs, but he's so in the way. Can you please move? No. <laughs> and here's my whole <laughs> So let's just go upstairs. That's where I'm gonna stay for the rest of my life. I thought she was getting your own apartment. Yes, I am. For now. So Okay, so you go to the right. There's a loft. This starts, this house starts at 189. And and then it has a closet right here. Oh, it's a furnace. Master bedroom. Oh, look at this closet. 
Plus, it's nice. I have enough furniture for this room. And here's a master bathroom. Oh, the toilet. What's this? Oh, the linen closet in the bathroom upstairs. Okay. Pretty. Okay. Now we're coming out of here. And we're going to go. It's Here's the laundry room. The laundry room is nice. Very nice. And then here's a bedroom. And here's another closet. Linen closet. Here's a bathroom. Oh, they have a tub. Everybody should have a bathtub. So here's the other bathroom. So there's two full baths and one half downstairs. And this would be Sydney's room. Of course, her room will be a lot more mature than this because she's past the stage. Okay, so then we're gonna go back downstairs. There's my husband sitting on the steps. Excuse me, babe. There's Sydney. Now we're gonna go in the kitchen. So there's no formal dining room. <laughs> you did it right, my friend. You did it right. I, I don't know if this has upgrades or downgrades or whatever. That's upgrades. This is upgrades, really. That's upgrades. Pantry. Huh? With the what? I mean, you got to buy it. Yeah. Oh, those those lighting and cereal, ceiling, that's an upgrade. You don't get all this. This no, is the model. Not if you pay for it. Just, just on the street, I just don't have a model yet. You don't pay for it. It's not free. Yeah, but you don't want it. Well, here at Fisher, we... Like crazy. How I mean, if you play church music or something. I like the backyard. You know? Oh, the house next door is nice. They really took care of the house. Yeah, I want speakers in the house. That's what. That's the problem. I think that's a problem too. But that's a problem. The less you pay, you don't take care of their stuff. Huh? She gets speakers in the house. Yes. Yes. I didn't know they liked it. You play your music. Just turn it on. You come in. It's a model. Oh, it's a model. I'm just. You can come in. This isn't my house. So yeah. Um. Okay. We are. So, hey there, how are you? Good, good. I didn't, I didn't upload the last one, so I have to come back and film again. So the question is, you, we're just, come, come we're in. visitors. We're just, we're yeah. like you. Uh, uh, Sean is not. Sean is uh, a different community today. I believe he's the one in, in black. Oh. Do you have his number? We were supposed to meet here, though. Uh, let me call him up right now. Okay. Oh, okay. what, what's your guy's name? Talking Mariama. About Mariama? Yeah. Okay, hold on one second. Hi. Hello. So are we trying to... I, I'm, I want to know if they have this house in a different neighborhood. If you like it. Yeah. I like this one. And you need a basement. Okay. Charles, Oh, she goes to your school? Yes. Oh. No, Mom. 
Hi there, how are you? Good. Nice to you? meet you. Nice to meet you too. Good luck in your home. Thank you. So. You'll be here in three minutes. Okay, so my husband. Yes, hi. Basement, hey. Yeah. He said he likes this house. I wasn't thrilled about it, but he came in here and he likes it. So, can you get this house built with the basement? Yes, how much is the basement? Basements are about fifteen to twenty thousand dollars, and this one basement's about twenty, a little bit over twenty. So, yeah, about two hundred thousand dollars. Yeah, this one and this community is uh, going to be about two or two, just a shade over. Is there any other community that has this particular house? Absolutely. He likes this yeah. house. So as long as it's part of our Maple Street collection, which is what this one is. I do have one more that's down on gender, where the red barn is. Make a left that's laying in the States is right here, with the wider lots. And that one with the basement is about 196. Really? Six, seven thousand dollars cheaper than you. Oh. Okay. So hold on. You hold on you guys. So I know you said that, that how much was the other one in layman? I accidentally drove over there. Yeah, it's uh, that one is one ninety six with so, a basement, just like this one. Okay, so but I don't want to go. I, why is it cheaper? Just depends on the location, depends on the land, just depends on so many different things. So. I mean, I can make it more if you want. No, no, no. <laughs> I don't want it more. <laughs> just saying. Yeah. I guess we should. They don't have a model, do they? No. Not so yet. then that we would have to drive through the neighborhood. Basically. Yeah. Because I'm, I'm looking at some of these. Yards around here, these people don't like they have in a homeowner's prime, and he can't say anything. I know, but um, um he may he he but the I'm houses are nice home, home to areas where they seem to be a little bit more. I'm not telling you guys where we're at well, with our know. HOAs. We're trying to make sure that we keep the prices low, but mm -hmm. still, where the HOA really talk to kind of gets Next the best bang for, for homeowners. I see so many beautiful ladies here in church today. I'm not only talking about beauty in the ecstatic way, but beauty that only God can create. But I see so few men here today.